Hi, um, my name is Ashish. I'm with l -B. For all you dreamers back there, it's Hashish without the H. <laughs> uh, I first of all want to thank Mike at DLA Piper for hosting us. You're um, Mike, we actually, unfortunately, right now use Wilson Sonsini. But I have to say, you guys serve much better food over here. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for having us. Uh, how many of you in this room have ever done sales? Okay, good. So one question for all of you, um, I'll probably pick on one person is, so you've done sales, uh, could you please tell me your name? Me? Uh, gentleman behind you. Tom. Tom. Tom, how many times have you been at a customer meeting where you meet somebody, you pitch your product or your solution or service, you thought the meeting went really well, and the person says, send me more information. You're excited, you go back to your desk, Open up your laptop, start typing out an email saying, Mr. Person, we met you yesterday. It was a phenomenal meeting. Here is some more information. You hit the send button, but you never hear back. Has that ever happened to you? Absolutely. Good. How many salespeople over here have had this issue? <laughs> Almost everybody over here. l -trip is a product to solve this issue. And we call this problem the problem of customer silence. The statistic is that salespeople waste most of their time in following up with leads or, or prospects that will never convert into revenue. And the golden rule, rule of sales, which most of the professional salespeople over here know, is that if you're, fo if you're following up on 10 accounts or 10 people, there are three deals that close for sure. And you know it. You know it because you're feeling the love from the customer. You go in and you try and close these three. There are four deals, however, that will never close. So the salesperson, you're better off not even worrying about those four. And the battle is usually between the middle three. They're kind of in between. You might be able to close them. You may not be able to close them. So l is a product that allows you to figure out where do these deals lie, which are the top 30% that will close, which are the 40% people you met. They were kind of nice. They asked for some information. You sent it to them. They didn't even bother to open your email. So please stop wasting your time in calling them up again and again. So Tom, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try and sell l to you today. I hope you're impressed with me. Please ask me to send you some more information, and I'll send that information to you now. <laughs> so thank you, Tom. It was a pleasure to meet you at DLA Piper. You seem like a nice gentleman. l to seem very cool. So what I've done for you is I've put together some information. I call it a topic inside of l What this has, it has a video that my team put together. It's a teaser video that most startups have. After that, I have a survey for you where I'd like to find out from you what's next. Would you like some more information? Would you like to schedule an in-person demo for me to come? And then, if you are even more adventurous, I also have a free trial offer for you. That will open up right here. And let me now send this off to you. So what I'll do, Tom, is I come here, I type your name. Can you please give me an email ID that you have that you get on your phone? Um, yes. Hathaway.tom at gmail.com. Wonderful. <laughs> Did I get the spelling right? Uh, is it H A T H A W A Y? Correct. Okay. Dot .com at gmail.com. Yes. So I'll do, I'll come here, I'll click on the share button, and then what happens is an email opens up automatically. I kind of already knows what I want to tell you. Tom, nice to see you today at SE Tech Demo Event at DLA Piper. Blah, blah, here's the information that you asked for. Let me just send this to you. So while I'm, I'm going to do this, Tom, with a couple of other people here. While I do this, please check your email. If, if you get an email from me, if you do, click on that link, and then tell me what happens. I need another email ID. Um, what the other sales people? Sir, could you give me an email ID from the gentleman right behind you? Yes, uh, it's gargiboy at yahoo.com. <laughs> gargiboy <laughs> at yahoo.com. Yahoo. <laughs> yes, brilliant. I'm oh, sorry, I forgot your name. Uh, Chandra.
Okay, I need a third email ID from anybody. Yes, sir. Four week startup at agileentrepreneurs.com. Your <laughs> <laughs> so name, sir. I may need your help. My name is Murali Devarakonda. So could you help me type that? <laughs> okay, Krishna. Krishna. Is that name? Yeah, that's my my name. Krishna. You can do it with two hands. <laughs> you can just say Krishna. That's fine. Okay. And, and in the email, four, the number four, week startup, startup at agileentrepreneurs.com. <laughs> That's what I do. Gonna you know. <laughs> Did I get it right? Yeah, four weeks start up. <laughs> four <laughs> weeks start up. Can I go for it? Yes, sir. Um, you have one more minute. Yeah, I want to. Oh. Okay, actually, I just have one more minute, so let me just stop it three prospects today. I'll get the last one. I just lost one customer. Oh, I, I apologize. I'll send you two topics instead of one. Okay, so quickly what I want to do is that, Tom, as soon as you clicked on that link that you got from me, what happened? Um, it's, it sent me a reading from you. Yeah, and then there's a link in there. When you click on that, what happens? I didn't click on the link. Oh, sorry, I forgot to tell you that part. My am apathetic, right? Yeah. It's a demo. Wonderful. So please click on, on the link. It'll ask you to confirm something. Go inside that. And Morley, could you please do the same? Krishna, sorry, can you do the same? Uh, Gargi Boy, can you do the same as well? Anyways, to cut a long story short, what El Shrupi is, it's a real-time sales and an analytics platform. What it allows salespeople to do is share information with prospects. And in real time, I'll be able to track what Mr. Tom over there, what Murli, and what Gargi Bawi here are doing. And it gives you real time analytics as to what, what is it that they're looking at from the proposal that you send them, and how much time are they spending on it. And at the end of the day, this is what sales is all about. It's about figuring out what's your hot lead that you should definitely close. What are the leads kind of somewhere in between that may matter? And then what are the leads that are just people being nice to you that may never close? And imagine this doing at scale in larger companies that have hundreds and thousands of salespeople and taking the power of analytics and making it available to marketing and to sales to, fig to give them leading indicators to the success of their products. Let me just stop here. Any questions? Um, so if I'm the kind of the person that you want to sell me this, are you going to tell me that you will track all the information that you are tracking now? If I want to sell you Ltropy, yeah, I will tell let's you. Say, let's say I'm, I, I gave you like my email address. Yes. Are you going to tell me that I will be tracked on your website, like every step I take, like to, you know, how long I spend on, you know, reading your stuff? Are you going to tell me? Once I develop a good relationship with you, yes. And a lot of times, <laughs> and a lot of times, it actually becomes a good conversation piece. Mm -hmm. So when I try and sell entropy to somebody, I say, hey, listen, sir, let me now show you how I was able to track you. And now, if you could do the same with your prospects, so on and so forth, how powerful that would be. However, I, I want to make, uh, sorry for being facetious, I just want to make a point that the demo that I just gave you is just the tip of the iceberg given the time that I had. There's a lot more technology behind it that makes things a little bit more fun. Okay, thank you. So people with hundreds of thousands of sales reps are, of course, already using picking from a range of tools, Salesforce or something else. Does this integrate with those or? Please repeat that's, the that's, question. The question okay. is people who have lots of salespeople are already using tools like Salesforce, does it integrate with those? The answer is yes. So integrate with Salesforce, Box, Dropbox, Google Drive, YouTube, Marketo. There are a bunch of integrations that we've, we've made. So what Entropy becomes is a salesperson's tool to curate the information for their prospect, share it with them, and let them have a good experience with respect to consuming their proposal. And then we take the data that gets generated, put it in Salesforce, for salespeople into Marketo for marketing. We can take files from Box, Dropbox, Google Docs, and enable everything over here. Uh, for sharing. And that's all the time we have. All right, thank you very much. I really appreciate it.